Hi everybody, it's Mrs. Ferris from Wood Library and I think it's time for a story or two. If you've ever come to Wood Library for story time, you know that I always have somebody special in my story bag. So I thought for these online story times, I ought to have a friend too. So let's see who's here. Oh, I think you'll know who it is. He's got a blue tail and he's got whiskers. It's Pete the cat. Yes, can you say hi, Pete? Now I invited Pete to be here because I like the way he deals with, well, when times don't go his way. Does he get upset? Goodness, no. And that's a fine way to be. Well, let's have your story, Pete. Our first story today is going to be Pete the Cat, I Love My White Shoes, with a story by Eric Litwin, created and illustrated by James Dean. Oops, making me kind of nervous. Now, Pete the Cat was walking down the street in his brand new white shoes. Oh, Pete loved his white shoes so much, he sang this song. I love my white shoes. I love my white shoes. I love my white shoes. Oh no! Pete stepped in a large pile of strawberries. And what color did it turn his shoes? Red. Did Pete cry? Oh, goodness, no! He kept walking along singing his song. I love my red shoes. I love my red shoes. I love my red shoes. Yeah. Oh no. He stepped in a large pile of blueberries. And what color did it turn his shoes? Blue. Did Pete cry? Goodness, no. He kept walking along singing his song. I love my blue shoes. I love my blue shoes. I love my blue shoes. Yeah. Oh no. Pete stepped in a large puddle of mud. And what color did it turn his shoes? Brown. Did Pete cry? Goodness, no. He kept walking along singing his song. He thought it was groovy. I love my brown shoes. I love my brown shoes. I love my brown shoes. Mm -hmm. Oh no, Pete stepped in a bucket of water and all the brown and all the blue and all the red were washed away. So what color were his shoes again? White. But now they were wet. Did Pete cry? Goodness, no. He kept walking along singing his song. Rock and roll. I love my wet shoes. I love my wet shoes. I love my wet shoes. Squeak, squeak. So the moral of Pete's story is, no matter what you step in, just keep walking along and singing your song because it's all good. Thanks, Pete. That was fun. Well, those are my stories for today. I hope you'll tune in again. We're hoping to do this story time every Wednesday on Facebook and, and uh, YouTube. So I hope you'll tune in. Be sure to leave comments. I'd love to be able to see you in person, but hopefully soon. Thanks for stopping by. Bye-bye.